expectations are just fantastic. Yeah, last video for the day. Anyway, yeah. Sounds very easy. It's the same concept with Jack too. We get the uh, face pod back in you know, our car. Or whatever you want to call it. You have to lower them into the uh, stuff. Which is not hard. Look at him. He can't even get over them. He's beating his chest or the rest. He comes the last one. I believe it is. Bah! That was the last one. He has one left. Yeah, he's gone back to normal. Sorry, pal. You're no angel. My head feels that hard. I've really got this. Here comes the other contestant. She's not happy about this. I'm serious. I managed to keep this half of the clockwork heart safe. It was hard to hide from the con oh, Contessa. She's getting away. Nah, sneaky, sneaky. Okay. Keeping the clock quite hot. She's getting away. She didn't get too far, did she? Can be struggle. Really, really struggle. That's it, Mario. Keep it up. Oh, the work, man. Anyway, so the, the, uh, the trick is you have to take out these bomb spiders. Alright, because you have flying bent in the well, she gets away. she's trying to get away, so he does it to slow you down. Obviously, okay. Here we go. Quick banter. Quit the banter. Let's get to the mission. So this one, my camera was really, really down in back. So obviously I didn't do that. Kaboom. And obviously after this you'll get a cut. This obviously can test the one away. You can hear me. That's why I just thought. You can see the green smoke. A lot of gas. The last spoil. Fight again. Yeah, you wish we, you really can go any wrong from this one. Go off another escape. All we gotta do is just take out the spiders and the three of us back together, she doesn't stand a chance. And then you'll be welcome for the cutscene. Into the next chapter, which obviously at the end, we have to face it on that chapter. Anyway, it's Hank Han 7, great to see you. And watch this clip to me, and obviously I'll see you later. Come like and subscribe and turn the notifications. Don't worry, I won't leave you, okay? I will.
Tessa, having escaped us in the prison, is now hiding out in her castle estate. It's a well-fortified, gothic nightmare that would make any thief run in terror. Terrible or not, that's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Clockwork Eyes. The Thievius Raccoonus describes the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what an accomplished hypnotist could do with such powerful artifacts. News of the Contessa's corruption has spread to Interpol. Constable Neela, being closest to the case, was granted a cash allowance to hire an army of local mercenaries. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war. But we have to act now, before things go from bad to worse.